to expand the schedule um, we can add more items to the BIM information associated with this model. You may notice when you select one of the room objects and such there are various categories within the identity data that we can fill in um, such as comments, occupancy, department, finishes um, these can show up in the schedule associated with the rooms. So let's add just a few in just to show you the principle of the thing. Comments too small, could be a comment. Occupancy secretary department. IT base finish mat undercoat ceiling finish stucco wall finish yellow paint Low finish carpet. Okay, I'm making this up as I go along. Okay, so let's move over to another office and we can see that the previous comments are in there as the drop down, so the department might still be IT base finish so they could be the same layout so you can see once you've inputted information you don't have to type them again um, okay we won't have comments in that one let's have the base finish though um, the same again ceiling finish all finish. Let's have red paint. Floor finish. Laminate. Okay, so how do we get that into the schedule? Okay, so those those uh, categories I've just typed in aren't um, aren't perfect, but for demonstration purposes. So at the moment that's the number of columns we have in the schedule. If we wish to add more, go to Edit Fields and you can see that we can start adding in some of these fields. They are already waiting there for us. Department. And last but not least, Comments. Uh, seems to be almost best practice to leave a comments column at the end of any schedule. Um, okay, so you can see those are there and I'm getting some of them filled in. Now what's nice with this is I can add, let me just drag this over for a second, so I can add comments in here if I wish rather than in the previous interface by clicking on the room itself and adding them in the properties as I've just done and this can be a lot quicker this can be a much quicker interface um, to large okay um, tiles so you can see now stuck on tiles is available Okay, so you get the idea there. Um, planning. So, okay. Click back on here, hit WT again to get an even spacing between the two. So you can now see that information is tagged to these rooms. This is information that can go down the um, the procurement and build um, line 
as part of a BIM workflow. Okay, thank you very much.